Tonight, the Brevard County man who spent more than 30 years behind bars is now out of prison and speaking out. He had his murder conviction overturned in 2018, but remained locked up while prosecutors appealed. News 6's James Barbero spoke to him today about the judge's ruling this week and what's next for his case. First of all, uh, I want to thank God. I want to thank God that I'm standing here today as a free man. Crosley Green's first words to reporters after 31 years in prison for a crime he says he didn't commit. His release last night is three years after his murder conviction was overturned. A judge citing the 63-year-old's health and the pandemic for allowing him to finally come home. Take this to where I'm standing, up under an oak tree. Something I haven't stood up under in 30-some years. It all started in 1989 in MIMS. 22-year-old Chip Flynn was shot and killed, and his girlfriend picked Green as the suspect out of a photo lineup. His defense arguing for three decades that Green was innocent and his rights were violated. Attorney Keith Harrison says he did not get a fair trial. A lot of evidence that uh, pointed to innocence was, was just ignored, and the federal court ruled that as a result, Crosley Green had been wrongfully convicted. The state is appealing that ruling, so the case is not closed yet. But even after all these years, Green's still considering himself a man of faith and holding his son, he says he's let go of all anger. I made it through then, I gotta make it through now. He's going, he's got me, he's got me covered. Until there's a ruling from the appellate court, Green has to live under house arrest and he must wear an ankle monitor. In Brevard County, I'm James Sparvero, getting results news six.